The Royal Australian Navy is working on a project to build an Arafura class offshore patrol vessel. Under the plan, 12 Arafura class ships worth 3.6 billion Australian dollars, about 2.22 billion US dollars, will replace the Amidale and Cape class patrol boats that have been in service since 2005. The main task of the class is to perform maritime patrol and law enforcement at sea. In addition, they can also detect and neutralize mines and hydrographic survey. According to Australian media, the first Arafura class patrol boat was launched at the Osborne Naval Shipyard in South Australia on December 16. Formerly named as HMAS Rafura OPV203. The ship is also the first of the 12 Rafura class. The Rafura class OPVs represent the future of Australia's border protection and will be the primarily asset for maritime patrol and response duties, said Australian Defence Minister Peter Dutton in his official press release. Based on the Lucent OPV-80 design, HMAS Rafura has 80 meters length, 13 meters beam, 4 meters draft, and a displacement of 1,640 tons, powered by two 5,700 diesel engines. The ship has a maximum speed of 20 knots and a maximum range of about 4,000 nautical miles. It can accommodate up to 60 troops, in addition to its 40 crews. The ship's main armament is a 40mm cannon, as well as two 12.7mm heavy machine guns. HMAS Rafura is also carrying two side launched 8.5m sea boats and one star launched 10.5m sea boat. It also has a fly deck for up to a medium sized helicopter, which also serves as a large part for its unmanned aerial vehicle. Mission specific equipment will be fitted to containerized modules, which can be exchanged for different modules when the ship needs to change drones. The use of containerized modules means that equipment can be upgraded without taking the ships out of service to refit, and if necessary, can be fitted to requisition civilian vessels. The modular system will allow a ship design for one role to be rapidly reconfigured to serve in another role. The construction of the second Arafura class OPV is now being carried out by Lucent Australia at the Osborne Naval Shipyard. The remaining 10 will be constructed by the same company at the Henderson Marine Precinct at Western Australia. My video about the Rafra class OPV answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Tạm biệt và hẹn gặp lại quý vị và các bạn trong các video tiếp theo.